right, guys. Welcome back to the shack. Uh, working on some pins tonight for the upcoming event, September the 9th. And if you're not familiar with it, go look at the events on my YouTube channel or my Facebook page. Uh, it'll be in uh, at Petals from the Past here in Chilton County, September the 9th. And these are going to be some little giveaway pins. Uh, I managed to get me about 2,000 of them. And so in order to get these things engraved, I was going to do it on the fiber. But, of course, it does just one at a time, and so I decided I'd just build myself a jig. And, guys, yes, I could have built this jig much, much larger, but this is exactly two handfuls of pins when I'm unloading and one large handful of pins when I'm loading. So that way I don't, you know, I, I basically have my measurements built in. I just grab what I can hold one hand, and that's enough to load it back most of the time. But anyway, guys, for people who say that you know these diodes aren't for production and you know you got to have a big co2 that costs you six eight thousand dollars to be able to do stuff like this it's not necessarily true now could i do this faster with one sure maybe but you can do a lot with these diodes this particular machine is the longer b1 i've been running it for quite a while now it's uh it's a really good machine automatic air assist limit switches does a good job it's tooling these things out at about 130 millimeters a second and uh, using the jig like this, guys, my setup is minimal. So if anybody ever says, you know, you can't use home position or you can't use <clears throat> absolute coordinates to do these, just, you know, send them over to the channel, let them watch some videos. But this is why I live and breathe by these jigs. 2,000 ink pens, guys. Now, you know how long that would take if I didn't have a jig kit set up like this. But anyway, <clears throat> I just think it's amazing to watch this machine work. Uh, that's why I enjoy lasers and CNC's and 3D printers and all that. Uh, it's just amazing to try to make things as efficient as possible. And, uh, you know, just sitting here chugging out these pins. So uh, that is the jig kit for the uh, longer B1 30 watt. And uh, if you're interested in getting any of the jig kits, guys, don't forget about my Etsy shop. Uh, most every machine I've had in the shop I made a kit for and I put those out there and that way you guys can download the files download the jig kits and uh, do the same thing like I said this uh, to me the, the the jig kits just kind of unlock a lot more capability with the machines so until next time guys be safe and have a good night